YouTube. This is direction or attribute part two. In this video, I'll show you uh, based on workflow, which one it's faster to work with. Let me go ahead and play the melody line. All right, so we are going to start first with the direction one. Let me bring the piano roll. All right, let's set this. I'm gonna go ahead and load the direction expression map. Make this bigger. All right, so we're gonna go ahead into first. So let's start the stopwatch and then we're going to do Arco first. Then next section we're going to do staccato. Then that one we're going to do a half trail. Then we're going to go back into staccato. Then we're going to do a full trill. Let me move that a little bit to the left of the notes. All right, so that's full trill. Then we'll go back to staccato. And then we're going to do runs. And then we're going to end with a marcato. All right, so let's stop the watch here, and we have 56 seconds. So let's play the melody again, see if it works. very good it works now keep in mind on direction you have to set those lines a little bit earlier than the notes to uh, affect uh, the changes so now let's do the same thing uh, with attribute let me move this actually I don't have to move that when you're on attribute let me just load the expression maps we're going to start the stopwatch, select the first section, then we're going to go up here to articulation, select arco. Next, we're going to select the uh, staccato notes. Now, with control, you can select all the staccato notes. Then, we're going to go up here, select staccato. Now, we're going to select the first to trill, second note over there to uh, full trail then we're gonna select this to run i'm gonna go up here select run then the last one is gonna be marcato okay stop the watch now we got 46 seconds so let's play the melody line see if it works So, oh, as you can see, it is faster to work with attribute than direction based on workflow. Now, in the first video that I did based on clicks, it was much faster to work with direction. So, because of that, I decided to update the uh, expression maps on my website. We just go to arpeggia.com, upright. Uh, corner musician zone expression maps now up here you can see the date the 
expression maps were updated. So if you downloaded before this date, I recommend to re-download uh, everything again. All right, so what you need to do is just click on the picture. Let's get Hollywood string. If I open that, I have the main folder and inside there's two more folders with attribute and direction. So every single uh, expression map on this page has that. Uh, now, these ones are the uh, custom expression maps. You just watch the video how to set up your instrument to work with that uh, expression map. All right, so I hope this helps you guys. See you next time.